For God is calling all men everywhere to repent. For he has appointed a day of judgment where he is going to judge you in righteousness. You are going to stand before the courts of heaven and you will give an account for your life. And you're going to go to hell. I'm going to continue warning about hell out here. Because the only way that you can get out of hell is you got to come to God. You got to be reconciled to the Lord. God is offering his love to you, but you cannot reject the love of God. The love of God is Jesus Christ. The Bible says that God demonstrated his love towards us. That while we was yet sinners, Jesus came and died for us. You needed a way of hope and God made a way for you to be saved. Yet you have to be willing to come to God. You must be willing to embrace the love of God and repent and turn out of the darkness because the world is passing away. Your life is not going to be here forever. There's a day where you're going to die. You're going to be judged. And my friends, if you've got any sense in your mind, you're going to be doing some serious thinking about where you're going to spend eternity because death is coming and God is offering mercy through his son Jesus. But you have to repent. If not, you're going to die in your rebellion and you are going to go to hell. Yet God doesn't want people to go to hell. People go to hell because they reject the Lord Jesus Christ. People go to hell is because they choose the darkness and they reject the light. That's what the Bible says, that men love darkness and they don't want God. That's why men go to hell. Yet your only way to come to a salvation of the Lord Jesus Christ is to humble yourself and come to God, repent, find forgiveness for your sins, stop being a drunkard, stop living your life outside of the salvation grace of Jesus Christ, and come to God and seek forgiveness for your sins. Humble yourself and truly get right with God. If not, you're going to go to hell. What are you shaking your head for, sir? Is baseball a sin? Baseball is not a sin. But there's men out here that don't know God. You living in rebellion towards the Lord, that's a sin. You are a sinner. The Bible says all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. That means you sin, you sin, you sin. You all have sinned. We all need salvation. Yes, sir. We all need salvation. And if you reject Jesus, sir, you're going to hell. Yet God doesn't want people to go to hell. This is why he sends preachers out here to preach to you. God doesn't want people to go to hell so he sends preachers out here to preach to you how can you hear sir without a preacher how can you hear about the salvation of the Lord if God doesn't send a preacher to you everyone has their job in life and God has his preachers to do their job and their job is to preach and to call the sinners to repentance because there is an appointed day where each person will stand before the judgment seat of God and they are going to give an account for their life. And while it is still today, you can come to God, you can stop living in your pride, you can humble yourself and you can find salvation for your soul. There's no forgiveness in hell. And while you have an opportunity you can find forgiveness through the Lord Jesus Christ so you don't go to hell. Yet you have to repent. If you continue going on, living for yourself, sir, you're going to die and go to hell. Yes, sir. You don't have to go to hell. You're getting old, sir. Yes, sir. I am warning you in the love of God because you are living in rebellion. Yes. And you find it offensive. Yeah, of course, you're going to stick the middle finger. Old people reject God. I'm not talking to you, sir. I'm talking to the other man. This old guy that's about to step out. Oh, you need to stop. I rebuke you, you spirit of anger. I rebuke you, you spirit of anger. 
Go over there. Okay. Keep your brain I rebuke watching. you and get out of here. Rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Repent, sir, before you die and go to hell. Repent and get right before you get die and you face the judgment for your sins. Come to the Lord while you still have an opportunity because God has appointed a day of judgment where he is going to judge the world in righteousness through his son Jesus Christ. For God is going to call each and every person's life into judgment. And while you are still alive, you can come to the Lord Jesus Christ. You can find salvation for your soul, but you must be willing to humble yourself and repent and believe the gospel.